welcome to supercars of oh gt3 red, red porsche gt3 i don't know whether you saw that but that's actually quite fitting hey guys welcome to oh, oh, oh. It's not how i, how I uh, intended on starting the video what's up everybody good morning Good afternoon and good evening, whatever time of the day that you are tuning in to Supercars of London to watch this video that I hope is going to be coming out on Saturday evening. At the moment, it's Saturday morning and um, as the title describes, I am not going supercar shopping. I'm tagging along with two people that are going supercar shopping. The idea of this video is I'm basically tagging along. I know that I've mentioned quite a lot that um, my second supercar is going to be coming this year, but it's not coming right now, and I'm not in any, uh, I'm not planning on doing my second supercar series yet. But I'm tagging along because I think that this video is going to be quite funny. I'm going to just film the majority of it on my iPhone. I'll use my video camera to film the convoy because the funny thing is, and I'm going to apologise straight up to Greenpeace here, is um, we're all meeting at a service station in all three cars and they're driving to this place together and we've all got V8s. Damon's obviously got a 6.2 litre um, V8. Tom's got, I don't even know what litre the BMW M3 is, but it's a V8 and I've got a 4.2 litre V8. Um, so we're gonna probably waste a lot of fuel, fuel that doesn't really need to be wasted, really, which um, definitely wasn't all right. I think it was a V10, so yeah, he's got one or two up on me, or, yeah, he's got two cylinders up on me, actually. I want to get the, your um, sail in as well. Petrol. 17 pound 14 is the most awkward amount of fuel I've ever seen anyone put in his car. <laughs> So everyone that knows these two cars in London think that they're the same colour when they're not parked next to each other, but as you can see, they're completely different colours. And here's Tom over here, who's already said that he's too boring on camera, but he's got a really loud uh, UV coat, correct? That um, is luminous at night time, glows in the dark. Safety first. <laughs> and he drives the uh, BMW M3 and just put 17 pound 14 P in his car. Talk me through that. Uh, it's a good amount. <laughs> <laughs> so as you can see, he's really, really boring, and he's going to be one of the people that um, is going to try not to waste the salesman's time <laughs> <laughs> by kicking tires, sitting in driver's seats. What else are you going to be doing? Uh, probably just pretending to steer, seeing how it handles when yeah, it's stationary. Yeah, 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 all of that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so um, yeah, this supercar shopping trip is. Um, Two cars down, one to go, and um, we're just hanging around. He said he was going to be here ten minutes ago. He's in the lay-by up from here, apparently. He just drove past. So he's missed. So he's missed the turning. So we're going to have to meet up with him. Fantastic. We going? Yeah. Yep. Let's go. Let's go. I don't want to. Boot space. Boot space. When do you get this one? Yeah. Land Rover. He's quicker than mine. That no, sounds bad. Yeah, it's trying out the handling. Who's like you're in front room? Yeah, just in my front room. Oof, that's tight. Jesus. Yeah. Kick a tire, see if it's on. Yep. 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 Yeah, you mix that would be good. Can you get out of there? Presumably. Oh, yes. Oh, Thought you were getting a Porsche. No. <laughs> so it's not even an AMG? No, no the exhaust don't come out the side. Let's it's a V8 it. though. Just 
hanging outside now in the showroom forecourt whilst Damon goes in probably to waste some salesman's time because <laughs> the car that he wants isn't even here. <laughs> <laughs> There's some nice bit, nice bit of kit over here, the E63. Hmm. Hasn't got black wheels though. But inside, they've got music playing, so I can't really do too much inside, um, because again, it will ruin the copyrights, but... Yes, this is where we are on a Saturday and it's raining and freezing. Tom's trying to understand the words that are on the piece of paper. <laughs> Let's, can I get through this way? Yes, I can. Check out these Land Rovers. And then this one that has got a motorway, hard shoulder, bit of metal there. Sorry, sorry, I'm using across the... Oh, yeah, because it takes a few weeks. waste a Saturday afternoon if you're a car fan you just head to your nearest supercar specialist and have a look around that's what I used to do quite a lot actually when I was a lot younger um, and I could drive so I'd just take my Vauxhall Astra and drive to the nearest Ferrari dealer probably the one that I used to work at and then just have a look at what they've got in stock and um, that place that we went to had uh, quite some cool stuff in there the Challenge Stradale was probably my favorite car but Damon was more interested in that great um, Gen 2 997 turbo which it was a pretty cool car, stupidly fast, much faster than my car, much faster than the two cars behind me as well. Um, so there we go, I hope you've enjoyed the video of um, how to go supercar shopping with um, three idiots, I suppose is the way uh, that you would describe this video. That's it, thank you for watching, make sure you subscribe, share and I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Cheers!